Yoga can be great for flexibility, strength, and balance. But for pregnant women, some of the positions can pose problems. Food and fitness coach Lori Corbin shows us why it's so important that moms to be get a little guidance. I am 36 weeks, so I'm due relatively soon now, any day. I'm due uh, October 21st. Wanting the best for their babies, Kim D2 and Trish Ward take yoga for mamas. That differs from traditional yoga. I encourage women in the second and third trimester to really come to a prenatal class or um, meet with an instructor who's had a baby because we understand how to modify correctly. Author and yoga expert Desi Bartlett, who's newly pregnant, says she sees a lack of education training pregnant women. I've heard about trainers who have held women in forearm plank for as long as they possibly can during second trimester, and there's no reason for that. Deep twisting poses also inappropriate. Twists are all about expelling. It's the last thing we want to do. The idea is to prepare for the big event, just like those getting ready for a marathon. They need tips on how to relax some areas and strengthen others for labor and delivery. Now, at this time of a woman's life, the front of her body, the rectus abdominis, is expanding. This is not a time to tighten up, but rather to expand. This is when they'll want to focus on the side or oblique muscles. What we want to do is we want to start to strengthen the side body, the obliques, and also the lower back. As the baby is growing, the belly is pulling forward and the low back is compressing, and you get sort of that Donald Duck posture. <laughs> so what I teach my, my gals is to press the tailbone down, and that will automatically draw the belly up and in safely. Bartlett also watches for diastis recti, a separation of the abdominal wall muscle that stems from improper exercise, lack of it, or too much weight gain. But it can be alleviated with a trained instructor or physical therapy. Lori Corbin, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Doctors always say that yoga is good for women who are pregnant, so at least now there's a safe way to do it. Yeah, very good. Denise, thank you so much. Well, our Feed SoCal campaign is underway, and you can help feed.